Good day, people. Where are we going today? Um, I'm just going to show you through a few things with this cashaddress.org Bitcoin. I've taken it from 0% and got it up to 50% before I'd show you because it just does take a while. But anyway, we've got to get this up to 100% and in the text box down below, instead of just doing variables straight away as it says, load in variables. And I've loaded in a wallet in the text box as a variable. So it's just only good for it's only really smarter to do than just put any variable in there at least it's loading the actual variables of the wallet then if you know what I mean so what we're doing is getting it up to yeah hundred percent well this is just sourcing for paper wallets um, colored paper wallets and stuff like that you can print the, the coloured paper wallets off on a printer and then scan the codes anywhere you like that they'll be scanned and used so yeah it's exciting stuff um, it's linked in with github and github's also linked with close boy well yes gitlab to deal with all sorts of things like mastering finance licenses and forking hotmail address, making your own stuff, your own APIs and stuff and collecting what business you do have and entering it into GitLab and enhancing it and stuff like that and getting what you can, the information you can out of it. So if you don't know what GitLab is and GitHub is, it's a good place to go have a look. So. We're nearly up to 100%. Um, what it's going to do, it's going to fold over and give us our paper wallets and stuff. So here we go. As you can see, I've got my wallet loaded there as a variable. And then just click the variables as all them green dots are. And we'll take it over 100% now. it's just clicked over see there's three two and three there shares things like and there's three see load verify and spend They're, I'm pretty sure when I look into Google on them wallets it says $50 on them so I don't know whether they've all got $50 on them already or not so it'd be exciting if they did because you can print off a lot of them and what we're doing is just creating a vanity wallet. We've got to generate a, sp a spare private key, a key, a public key. We get the public key, as you see, and load it into notes. Oops, wrong one. We'll get the public key, load it into first note, and then we've got to get a... I'm going to try a couple of things while I'm doing this. We're We'll get a second key, generate a second key. Like I said, I'm gonna try something and use this first public second key as second key, but I don't think it'll work. Anyway, I'll get back to loading it with the single line private key, step one, the second line, step second, the second step, sorry. Oh, lost there private keys first step one line private key goes in that note pull part note cannot mult yeah it's because I didn't put the right private key and I'm gonna have to generate another private key but I don't think this one's gonna work either so can only try because I've put it in once already, I don't think it's gonna do it. So yeah, I have to generate another private key. We'll generate another private key and log it in. 
I need help people really bad with this stuff too, so if you can help, subscribe and or send us a message, a text message, and get back to me. So here we go, I've done it now and created the vanity wallet, see there we go. So if you can people, subscribe and um, give me a hoy on what to do and how to start generating some cash into our pockets so like I've done as far as it goes with that but yeah like I said I'm a bit stuck I need some help um I'm in it for the long haul creating business and I've been offered to create my own bitcore bitcoin bitcore sort of stuff so help and subscribe people thank you